assalamu alaikum welcome to nasir soft in this video i am going to show you how you can add the swagger api in your laravel application okay so swagger is basically a beautiful api documentation uh, basically api okay so for this first of all copy this command okay that is composer require their course forward slash and swagger hyphen php okay copy this command and open your laravel application inside the terminal paste this command press enter and here the basically through composer the swagger php will be uh, installed okay so in this video step by step i will show you all the step how you can install the swagger in your laravel application okay so after successful execution of the first command now write this command that is composer require dark online forward slash l5 and then the swagger hyphen swagger okay run this command after running this command okay so the different installation will be okay so this the second step is also successfully now in the third step okay copy this command and paste this command as well that is php artisan vendor publish and then the provider okay so after that move to the next step that is step number five okay so this command is executed successfully sorry step number four the step four is we will add the different line of code okay in the top of the uh, controller main controller okay so in laravel all controllers extend from the main controller okay so inside your main controller that is the main controller okay here paste this command and here you can basically set the title of your api okay and something like that so this is the main controller inside the http controllers okay so paste this command and use this open ai attribute as well okay after that so basically in this uh, we will set the title and different documentation of the swagger title okay so the step 5 is after uh, adding this line now we will include the swagger line of code on the top of each method okay so basically of each uh, controller so whatever the route will call okay so on the top of the method we will tell the swagger what to do okay for example inside this for example this is my tos controller and inside the this is the route okay for example the tos controller index method so inside this index above this index paste this line of code for the get okay so here we define the path we define the summary we define the descriptions and the tags tags are basically the groups okay so after adding this on the sixth step now we will run the swagger okay so whatever we update the swagger uh, code on the top of the method we will again generate the swagger that is php artisan l5 hyphen swagger hyphen generate okay run this command when we run this command it will generate the documents okay for example for testing go to that specific that uh, your local host and then api and documentation here you can see that the one tags tos is added so now we only add the get method uh, swagger api okay so we will add this to all the crud operations okay so here you can see that the tags the summary is automatically fetches from this api and you can test as well from here okay now we will move to add the swagger documentation for the store for the update and other method as well okay for the, for example for the store we will post okay i define this route as a post so for the post here you can see that how we can define the path the summary the descriptions and the parameters for example inside this uh, post we have two um, inputs that we post that is name and year so we will define also here okay after execution again the command that is swagger uh, regenerate okay that is again execute this command that is php artisan l5 swagger generate and after that if i refresh here you can see that inside the tos now the post one is also added okay so here by default it's showing me the two the name and year will be posted and we can test as well so this is how you can basically 
add the Swagger documentation in your Laravel application. If you want to contact me inside the video comment description, click on this link that is contact link, fill your criteria, your name, your email, whatever message you want and you can also send me a uh, attached file. For example, if you want to hire me, you can directly attach your uh, word file or something like, okay. So I will answer it to you. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe my channel for more informative videos. Stay blessed. Have a nice day.